The Terminator is the iconic rescue robot. Its mission is to save people, the planet, and ultimately the species. Of course, it's science fiction. It runs faster, it's stronger, endures more than any human. The real robots began with cleanup of the first nuclear accident. These were developed to explore, then to work with tools, and to perform the tasks uh, that uh, finally closed that event. The story in the world is that these accidents will never happen again, but robots had a great role at Chernobyl, and Robotox was unprepared for what was needed at Fukushima, where they're being developed and used for years and years yet to come. A real advantage is underwater, where robots were the only possibility to discover Air France 447, then to find those parts on the ocean bottom, and ultimately to recover the flight recorder. There are even uh, greater roles in the undersea disasters, uh, like capping a leaking oil well, where the only thing that we can see and the only thing that we can do is by the means of these machines that go where we cannot. For rescue in underground mines, robots can go further, faster, to find downed miners. They can operate in the dust, smoke, explosive gases, and uh, risks that human rescuers cannot. However, they don't have the advantage of GPS, so they have to sense where they are in order to determine where they're going, what turns to make, how to do the, those actions, and also uh, where they can go and where they cannot. So these machines are fantastic at uh, mapping, knowing where they are, knowing where they're going, uh, finding people, but they don't make the judgments about degree of injury or how to handle, whether to handle, or uh, high-level decisions. These search and rescue robots are highly successful, uh, particularly in wilderness search. Uh, one of the favorites is rescuing a window washer uh, high on a building, after which the government uh, declared the Drones for Good program. Even more injuries will be prevented than responded to. Automation technology um, particularly uh, prevents accidents in the very young and the older drivers like me. The uh, resistances are things like concern for possible injury, liability, what does it take to develop these machines, how to infuse them in operation, but uh, all that is being overcome. No robot today is anywhere close to the skill of a baby. Uh, it's why it's necessary to develop the mobility technology, the manipulation, better sensing, um, planning, and to integrate those into the many types of machines required. Initially, the motivations were hazard, but now most of it is efficiency, productivity, in some cases, profit. That the robots yet to come uh, may include interaction with infectious disease, perhaps to isolate, to sterilize, to treat and transport, and for purposes from mountain rescue to fire response. Always, always uh, the work on the world and rescue will be by humans. Uh, these robots are just the new tools for saving people and the planet.